Hello, I wanted to set the stage for a series of videos we're planning over the next few weeks talking about what is now really a GIS revolution, how GIS is changing. We've written some articles uh, in our blog which have met with a considerable response from people reading them. One of them is what you look at on the screen here is so you want to integrate your desktop web and mobile GIS apps. Um, we've also written a number on data collection as well which again have, have met with uh, lots of responses. So we thought a series of videos just talking more about uh, how GIS is changing and some of the applications of GIS now would be uh, of interest. So the kind of things that we're going to be talking about really are, are mobile, their web um, and their desktop as well and how now we can integrate that world together using cloud technology. Um, so really the things we'll be talking about in this series of uh, videos is things like executive dashboards on the web, how executives can get quick snapshots of data from across organizations and make quick decisions on that. Um, we're also going to be looking at specific web applications as well like the one you're looking at here, how we can now use JavaScript in particular to build quickly very focused applications which are for use um, on the web. Other examples will include specific, very, very specific focused apps. In this case, this is a, a location analytics application which allows you to dynamically generate demographic information about a particular location. Very useful in the commercial world. So we'll be talking in more depth about these type of applications which are web, fo web and focused and are leveraging cloud technology. Finally, we'll probably be talking a little bit more about some of the ways that uh, users can, uh, can actually get access to very specific web applications and mobile applications which are GIS targeted, in this case ArcGIS. So we'll talk about Marketplace which is a, a portal really to access and get, at, get uh, at very focused applications which are targeting the ArcGIS Online platform. On the mobile side of things, we'll be talking specifically about uh, some of the mobile applications that are out there that we find useful, some of the ones we've released and some of the ones that uh, Esri have released as well and, and others. So we'll be talking specifically about data collection, We'll be talking about the offline editing application that we've got out there um, in Marketplace which allows you to go on and offline to do, uh, to do your editing. We're also going to be talking about Collector as well and contrast and comparing Collector now with offline with something like our applications which you're looking at on the screen. So those are applications which are installed applications. These are applications you're going to get from the Apple and, and Android stores. We'll also be talking about web applications. So we can now start, we can now build applications which are called responsive. So we can actually build the one application on the web, which, is, which looks good on a, on a tablet like you're looking at on the screen here, um, and also looks good on a phone. So this same application would, run, would, would, look, would look good on an iPhone as it does on this iPad that you're looking at here. So we'll talk a little bit more about responsive design and how you can build one application now, one web application which runs across all devices. So the series of videos will basically introduce you to this sort of brave new world of GIS and you know we're as a company we're very very excited about the possibilities now that uh, we can now build so many different solutions for clients which affect not just individuals but they affect across the organization in, in, in many different verticals including commercial public sector and, and, and many others so we look forward to generating and, and your feedback on these videos. Uh, thanks for watching.